Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel The Informant. If you are new to this channel, let me just remind you that we make videos related to online services, education, placement drives and many. If you have not subscribed to our channel yet, please do hit the red button so that you get latest notifications first on your screen. So as you all can see, our today's video is about top 10 engineering colleges of Karnataka with highest placements. So many of you have already written your CET exam, right? And you are waiting for your results and for your counselling, etc. So now you all will be in confusion which engineering college to select. So you can you ask your friends, family like they have uh, you know been passed out from so and so college and they have got this this much amount of package. But this data will be not accurate. You'll be knowing about one or two colleges. But what about whole of the Karnataka? Which college will provide you highest placements? Because that is what that matters at the end, right? In engineering, only good college, good good faculty will not matter you much. Of course, it will matter, but the most mattered thing, if you ask uh, to a graduate, is placement package, what salary he got, because that is what will decide his next life ahead, right? So, in this college, uh, in this video, we'll be, you know, describing, we'll be uh, dis distinguishing the colleges with highest packages in Karnataka, because you are writing CET, or if you are not writing CET, you have opportunity, you can go anywhere in Karnataka. So. This is your life changing moment. Why to you know take decision asking some of your cousin or one or two person. You explore whole of the colleges and see what best option you can select. So we'll be also discussing few subtopics that is whether let it let your CET ranking be one or one lakh, anything between this, which college you must select with best placements. Right? You'll be having a doubt which college. Assume your CET ranking, if it is less than twenty thousand, thirty thousand max. You can get into a good to decent college, but what if your CET ranking is between 30 to 50, 60,000? You know, uh, so many students who are talented due to some errors, they land up in this uh, range of ranking. So, what to do? You can still get a decent package. We will suggest you few colleges, you know, where you can get around, you know, 4.5, 5 lakh package to 10 to 12 lakh package as well. There are many tier B colleges who offer these things. So you, you, you no need to, you know, just get sad that you did not get that ranking. You can still make a good career out of it. And one question which, you know, I had a, I, when I was a student, I had this question. Is branch important or college? So this is one of the most important question we'll be discussing at the end of this video. So please stay tuned. So first of all, I'll be showing you the list. This is not the end. As per NIRF ranking, so where are Karnataka colleges stand? This is all India ranking. So you can see very some good colleges. We'll leave about NIT and IITs. If we see other than that, you can see Ramaya Institute of Technology, RV College of Engineering, BMS College, then BS University, JSS Science and Technology University in Mysore, Siddhanga Institute of Technology. This is that is in Tumkur. And you can see PS College of Engineering, Mandya. NIE National Institute of Engineering Mysore. So these are the few prominent colleges and what we'll be doing is now we'll be distinguishing the colleges based upon their placement. This was only on their NIRF ranking but now I'll be showing you detailed analysis where we'll be showing you college with best placements as well as the cutoff right. Only placement is not uh, required uh, you need to know the cutoff as well right. So we'll be showing you example Ramaya Institute of Technology is one of the top colleges in Karnataka. So I'll be showing you the Ramaya Institute of Technology placement records, how much placements uh, you know they offer or they have been offering from last few years, and what is the ranking you need to uh, you know average ranking considering the last year previous years rankings. We'll be telling you what ranking if you get you can land up into this college. So you don't have any doubt, right? So let's start and uh, this one slide is for the criteria how NIRF ranks the colleges. If you want you can look into it. It's gen like general information. So first one is RV College of Engineering, right? RV College of Engineering you can see over here if you are a general merit student. Let's consider general merit instead of any category. Category also category students also can look over here, but I'll be discussing only general merit. So if you can see for artificial intelligence, you can see how less the cutoff is that is 660 from whole of Karnataka your cutoff should be 660 
the whereas for other branches non it branches like civil you can see 18000 for chemical 12000 but again for cs you can see 310 is the cut off cyber security 726 in rv college it is not going above 1000 you know in terms of circuit branches you can see data science 511 969 right after this 3 br column you can see gm column there you can see the cut offs so how tight competition is in rv college of engineering you can see over here and next if you see the cut off of rv you can see the placements of rv college of engineering the highest ctc if you can see over here in 2023 it was 62 lakhs but in 2024 they have offered 92 lakhs ctc that is huge i think it is la- the highest in karnataka in terms of you know non iit colleges highest in karnataka 92 lakhs and you can see the stats they have given very good stats 2024 you can see over here the number of you know uh, companies and number of offers they gave 238 companies 778 offers and here you can see in 2024 between 12 to 14 lakhs like after about 14 lakhs packages 253 packages 253 offers about 14 lakhs and 8 to 12 lakhs also 244 the like basically 0 to 6 lakhs is only 76 that is the least like less package only uh, 76 but above 6 lakhs they have like majority are of offers are above 6 lakhs or above 8 lakhs you can see you can pause and you can see the data branch wise also you can see mechanical students have also got placed 108 mechanical students cs obviously 210 ec is 171 right so this is just a demo f- for rv college so are as as we show you, showed you for rv college will be showing for all other colleges which are uh, you know are, are on our list so first one is rv college you got to know the ranking the cut off how much it should be and one thing if example now you want to get into this rv college it is very good college right you want to get into this rv college but you want uh, you want you have all you also have interest in computer science engineering this uh, th- like this is very confusing state because college provides you good opportunity like they many mass companies come where you being a mechanical student you can get into it companies as well right but you have a confusion you want to study cs itself so if if college is like rv and for you placement matters the most then you can you know get into rv college you can get into civil or mechanical where you can see cut off is around 18000 industrial engineering like any other engineering courses you can get where 18000 and you can try for branch change first of all many students will be not knowing about this you can change your branch after first year if you get a very good uh, you know gpa you can change your branch otherwise you can you know study in that field additionally you can you know do some coding courses or any other courses related to it which you have keen interest in and then when final year when placement arrives you can you know request your of uh, placement officer Where, where majority of the you know students get placed in CS IT, they they give minimum eligibility criteria only from CS or uh, IT background. You can request your placement officer, or you can sit in the mass companies, like many mass companies come where they don't have you know branch requirement. There you can sit and you can crack. So this is uh, the uh, answer for our final last question over there. so we'll go to our next college that is bms college of engineering you can see in bms college of engineering cut off is you know slightly higher than rv college where uh, you can see for artificial intelligence for general merit it is around 2000 for uh, computer science around 2000 but for civil you can see over here 51000 it has gone up to 51000 chemical 20000 and electrical 10000 for mechanical it is 27000 but for cs you can see it is around 2000 2000 right and for main computer science it is 1027 in bms college of engineering and if you see the placement records of bms college of engineering highest package is 50 lpa average package is 8.24 lpa lowest is 6 lpa and placement rate is 76.33% you can see the batch size total number of students registered and who got placed right in this majority of the students you know they will be opting for masters who, are, who who will be considering masters they will not sit for placement so don't go on this numbers like uh, okay only 76 plus bms is a very good college definitely if you have good skills you'll get placed 
you can see the records total number of offers total number of in internship you can just pause and see next is ms ramaya institute of technology and here you can see the cutoff for artificial intelligence course same like bms 2800 2400 and for cs you can see 1171 and for mechanical it is around you know 27000 you can see the cutoffs over here and you can see the placement so highest lpa uh, highest package in 2023 was 50 lpa 2024 is ongoing still placements are ongoing and still now they have got highest package of 48 right and you can see when branch wise offers made the stats also i hope you guys are clear so ps university bangalore this is also one of the good universities so you can see over here uh, for uh, cs the cutoff is 1124 ps university and for pc and ai other courses cutoff is 1700 and 3800 you can pause and see over here and see if you see the placement records highest salary 2023 was 65 lpm you know this is also huge 25 lpm right and average salary package you can get over here is 7.5 lpm 65 lpm not everyone can get like one or two student can crack this uh, you know 65 lpm thing but rest of the students they get into 17 18 lpm 12 lpm 8 lpm depending upon the skills right Next, you can see SJC Mysore. This so all these colleges before were from Bangalore, majority of them. Now this is first college from Mysore, and it is topmost engineering college of Mysore. Here you can see for computer science the cutoff is 2,800. Right. For electrical electronics it is uh, 17,000 and 31,000 respectively. And uh, trust me, they have, even they also give very good, uh, you know, salary packages. If you can see they have stats uh, where you can see 2023 how many how many students got placed from these departments and next is NI Mysore another college from Mysore so these two are topmost colleges in Mysore and here you can see for computer science around 5000 is the cutoff 5000 for information science it is 7000 for CS AI machine learning those things 8000 right in NI Mysore and you can see the placement stats over here so last 2022 stats I could get in 2022 the highest package was 43 lakhs and uh, they have you know added 200 plus new companies so 470 recruiters total in 2022 760 students placed 1080 offers so 828 students were eligible in that 760 students got placed so it is very good placement percentage right so next is BIT again Bangalore Institute of Technology you can see over here for uh, uh, computer science cutoff in BIT is 5500 right and for mechanical it is 75,000 so you can easily get you know mechanical in this college but CS it, as you all know it has huge demand so cutoff will be tight you can see in in majority of the good colleges inside 5000 it's like uh, if you go to RV and uh, Ramaya there it is inside thousand but if you go little you know ex uh, little more colleges if you explore you can get like BIT you can get around 5000 SJC and I and they have you know given very detailed packages uh, where how many students got placed and what was the package they got here you can see a uh, candidate has been recruited for google in you know row number 60 google 57.57 lpa in google and many other good packages like 10 lpa in zebra technologies 12 lpa in press 14.5 lpa in you know this thing goldman sachs 24 lpa so they have, they have you know given detailed reports next is bvb hubli so all these above colleges were basically you know south of karnataka bangalore mysore region but uh, few of the candidates might uh, who, who are from north karnataka are watching a video from north karnataka so which college you should go so when we researched we found that bvb hubli kletu 
this is uh, one of the good colleges over there and here you can see the cutoff for uh, artificial intelligence it is around 25000 for computer science it is around 16000 electronics 22000 so decent college with decent cutoff uh, average student can get get into this very easily and highest package what we could find was 43 lp which is also very huge and 40 students selected by amazon aws so amazon aws like 40 students and in 2022 by 1500 plus offers were made so they also had a very good you know track record so this was all about our today's video guys i hope you find this information you know useful so we tried to we had put in a lot of effort in this video you know get gathering all the data stats so that we can get the best for you right so again and at starting of video if you have you know come till this end i'll be telling you that if you you know if you are waiting for that if you want a video on like you have uh, you're ranking like around 30,000 25,000 and you want to get into cs so which are good colleges other than it's top-notch colleges where you can get good packages so if you want this video please drop down in the comment section if you if many like if you, many of you drop down in the comment section we'll surely make a video on that no doubt we'll make a video on that and also on coming to our last question which is branch important or college so see depends on you right so it depends on your skill so many of you in engineering no doubt colleges first because repetition of the college comes first uh, average student you know who, who gets into good colleges he has opportunities right he has very good opportunities he can see his, he can see companies coming into his college if he put in his effort he can get get into that whereas if you select branch then you need to back up your skill right you need to create you need to develop your skill in such a way that placement doesn't matter for you you can get from off campus itself see if you are a you know highly talented student assume you got 10 out of 10 cgpa but what if the college which you have joined you have joined in a cs course and college which you have joined they can afford to bring a company with maximum of 8 lpa package they cannot afford to bring a company which provides more than that package what will you do whereas if you get into some good college like rv bms assuming and you 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 have compromised a bra your branch have you have if you have studied something right and you have you work upon your skill meanwhile they can give you easily 10 to 12 package in a mass company in it itself so this is the difference this is your call totally depends on you i hope you get this still if you have any doubts please drop down in the comment section and we have a series of videos right uh, in uh, kcet every uh, document verification fee structure all the videos so students who are waiting for their uh, results you know very good luck and will be you know giving you series of videos will be helping you till you get uh, you admitted into your desired college thank you guys stay tuned <music>